become one of the art world's greatest and most popular exhibitions, and it's like nothing else that you've ever really experienced. A fully immersive video production that highlights and blends artist Vincent van Gogh's breathtaking paintings into an hour-long video streaming presentation choreographed to music. I dream my painting and paint my dreams. These are the words attributed to uh, Van Gogh by the Canadian artist Colm Fiore uh, in a presentation on the exhibit's online application. Van Gogh's paintings are presented in an almost dreamlike sequence so that his work unfolds as you follow them in the streaming video, exposing many faces and facets of the artist's mesmerizing masterpiece. should not miss this unique opportunity. To see the exhibit, you'll need two things, a ticket which costs around $55, and the Lighthouse online app, named after the new space which was constructed in the corner of Kawanga and Sunset to house the exhibit. The app is important as it can be used as a play-along guide when you're watching the exhibit itself, and it doesn't hurt to have a private invitation from the exhibit's staff. Go. Hello, my name is Kelsey and I work here at Lighthouse with the Van Gogh Immersive. Um, we get about like 300 people per hour, about 4,000 within a day. Uh, we're running till January, so you guys should come on in. The experience is absolutely wonderful. You get captivated within the art and you feel like you're a part of the artwork. For providing some background about the exhibition itself, let's look at why Van Gogh? Why was he so important? Van Gogh was one of the most prolific yet tortured artists of his time, but it is precisely because of this struggle that his art was so vivid and full of life. As Comfiore notes, Van Gogh did not start painting until he was 27 years old and painted for nearly 10 years before his untimely death, but in that time he produced over 900 oil paintings. According to biographer Richard Orsuzian, Van Gogh struggled his whole life with what today would be labeled severe bipolar depression leading eventually to his suicide at age 37 in 1890. But Asuzian contends that many of Van Gogh's paintings highlight his, his inner struggles, with his almost uh, ferocious brushstrokes and his yellow paintings representing an attempt to choose life over death, and even his more subdued blue paintings showing a struggle to maintain his sanity. In fact, Van Gogh's Starry Starry Night was actually painted during his time in a mental institution. As reporter Christina Morales notes in a September 22nd article in the New York Times, experts say that Van Gogh's popularity arises from the fact that his images of people, landscapes, and lives are so accessible. But the story of his life, including a struggle with mental health, also resonates with many. So what is the best way to view Van Gogh's works? With the possible exception of the Van Gogh Museum in Amsterdam, the Van Gogh Immersion Exhibit is the best way uh, to see so many works represented and portrayed in so many different formats. The Van Gogh Exhibit has become one of the more popular venues for viewing the artist's works because um, it attracts so many from uh, over one million people have viewed the works in uh, multiple cities around the world. I would actually argue that the Van Gogh Immersive Exhibit is almost better than viewing the original paintings. Uh, while over 200 of his oil paintings are, can be seen at the Van Gogh Museum in Amsterdam, many of his most famous works are actually spread out in different museums throughout the world, such as Starry Starry Night, which is um, held at the Museum of Modern Art in New York. Although you won't get to see the original works, the video representations of the immersive exhibit are so vividly portrayed that they're almost better than the original. According to the Lighthouse app, the exhibit uses 60,000 frames of video, 90 million pixels, and over 500,000 cubic feet of projections to portray the artist's work. A June 1st article in Art News states 
that the immersive Van Gogh exhibit is the brainchild of Italian film producer Massimiliano Sicardi. It is also accompanied by a haunting musical score produced by composer Luco Longobardi. Looking back, we can see that the immersive Van Gogh exhibit gives us the ability to view so many amazing works of the, one of the greatest painters of all time in a new light. A painter who, despite his personal struggles, perhaps because of them, was able to bless us with so many original masterpieces. Despite Van Gogh's early and untimely death, the Van Gogh immersive exhibit allows us to see Van Gogh's paintings come to life before our very eyes.